Hi, this is Charles Scamahorn again, trying to describe to you why I have chosen one drop of Hibiclens in a glass of water for a nasal wash. And the object of doing a nasal wash is to get the uh, coronavirus out of your sinuses and killed. When people catch the disease, it's often as not from somebody going, <coughs> like that, and they blow stuff out there, and you get it, or they wipe their face like this, and then they open a doorknob, and, uh, you know, then you come along and touch the doorknob and lift your face and maybe breathe the air. In any case, where this disease begins is probably almost always in the sinuses, and, and that's okay if it doesn't do a nasal drip down into your lungs. You want to do everything conceivable to keep that stuff out of your lungs. And it's the snot in your nose, the dribble, the post-nasal drip. That's what you want to stop. But there's no way of doing it the, the, the way they're talking about it in the media. Here's what I propose and what I'll show you how to do. <clears throat> we start with Hibiblin, Hibiclens, and then we take and put 10 drops of Hibiclens into this bottle. So I, I take the, the thing, hold it down there and see how much I got there. And then I drip it. There goes one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. I might have got 11. Okay. And then we take this stuff and we shake it up. This will be a dilution of 10 drops for 200 milliliters. I'm going to take that level of concentration and pour it into this little container. It's 20 milliliters. So that's one tenth. Okay, we're gonna do this and do it several times. I pour that in there like that. Do -do -do -do. Now this will have one drop of hip cleanse in there. See, it foams up nicely, so it shows that there's some soap in there. Hip cleanse soap. I'm gonna do that as quickly as I can for you. Try not to spill it. And then I'm gonna shake that one up. Now this one is concentrated one-tenth of a drop for the 200 milliliters. The 200 milliliters is about a cup. Okay, we do it again. You know how this is going to turn out, I hope. I don't know if this is going to get sudsy or not. Oops, go in there. Because now, we are only doing it at one part in a hundred. This is one part in a hundred. Is that going to frost? Tiny bit, maybe not much. Do it one more time. This will be one part in a thousand. And shake that up. Oops, put this cap on it. Do we have any froth there at all? A tiny, tiny bit. Back with the one in a hundred. That's one in a thousand, right? This is one in a hundred. It's got a little bit of froth. This is one drop, one drop of Hibiclens in 200 milliliters water. In other words, one drop in a cup. And this was uh, our original concentration of uh, like that. Now, my feeling is that, oops, we got one more over here. Yeah. Uh, I don't have to get for it, so, and there. Now I'm making the assumption that this is maybe too strong to put in your nose. And that here, that one drop in 200 milliliters is about right. So here I'm going to demonstrate at the concentration that I believe is healthy. And you can point at my face now and my hand. And I'm going to pour out about, about that much. You can, can you see it there? And I'm going to... This doesn't burn. I'm sucking it in and out to make it totally cover my sinuses. That's the object. So I'm now scrubbing my sinuses clean like 
they recommend you clean your hands clean. But once you got the disease or it's in the air, this is the way to go. So I think if you do this, you're going to survive the current epidemic. Bye. That's all. Me, Charles Scamhorn. Oh, probeaway.wordpress.com. I have a little more discussion on the whys and wherefores of this. Bye, folks.